My name is Moses Kinanjaroge. Since my childhood, I've been a curious and a passionate innovator. And our dream is not only to live uh, five years is, or ten years, is to live hundreds of years, trying to come up with ideas that will aid the mobility of persons living with disability or help persons who are in need. The device's mechanism is straightforward yet effective. It employs a headset to monitor brain signals and translate them into commands for the prosthetic arm. This hand is being controlled by this neural road by a potential headset receiver that monitors or taps the brain signals and it extracts these specific features of these brain signals that reflects the intent of the user explains one of the innovators. The process involves converting these signals into usable electrical currents via radio waves, which then drive the arm's linear motors to mimic natural hand movements, allowing for actions like gripping or releasing objects based on the user's thoughts. Unlike traditional prosthetics that might rely on muscle signals for operation, this design uses a neuron node biopotential headset for detecting neural signals, offering a more intuitive and natural control mechanism.